On today's video, you're going to learn how to connect PVC pipe to clay pipe. This is all part of a floor trap project that I'm working on replacing. And if you like these kinds of projects, make sure to click the little subscribe button below. And if you want to see more about this, make sure to check out the main video on how to replace that basement floor trap. To connect two dissimilar pipes though, what you really need is either a Fernco connector, which is a trade name, or another one's called a no hub connector. The main difference between the two is the Fernco is gonna be all rubber. Sometimes the Fernco is a little bit thicker Whereas the no hub connector is gonna be a rubber inside with a metal ring around it. And I like the ones with the metal ring because if there is any, um, you know, shear on those two pipes, it's gonna provide a little bit more structure to stop the two pipes from breaking apart. Now, in a situation like me, I'm connecting a three inch PVC to a three inch clay pipe. And that's basically a three and a half inch OD to a four inch OD. So there's going to be a step in my connector and those are hard to get with the metal ring around them. So I'm using the Fernco style here. Now this is a part number 1059-33. It's basically three and a half inches to four inches. And these are really hard to find. So I'll put a link to these in the description um, because even my local plumbing store didn't exactly have the right one for my application here. But we'll go ahead and I'll show you in the hole that I'm working here and just kind of show you how to connect these two pipes together. So we've got our trap all fitted and purple primered and glued together, except for the little stack pipe that'll go here to connect to the floor fixture. So now we're going to go ahead and take our rubber, rubber coupler and connect to the clay pipe. And I've loosened my pipe clamp or my hose clamp here just about as much as I can because um, I don't want that getting in my way here. I'll put that on. And then all we have to do is connect the PVC and tighten our hose clamps. And just make sure it doesn't get bunched up here. There it goes. And this should seat about two inches in. So I left two inches of overhang on my pipe here. And actually, looking at what I have, I actually could have used a four inch to four inch and just coupled directly to this. So whatever you can find would work in that scenario. And we'll make sure this has just a hair of slope towards the main pipe here before I tighten everything down. And that's all you have to do to couple PVC to clay. And now what I'm going to do before I kind of close this all up, I'm, I'm going to pour some gravel around this just to make sure that it's kind of supported and no big you know rocks or anything kind of push against it to disrupt it. <laughs> 